Konami is reprinting Legend of Blue Eyes. It is the 25th anniversary of Yu-Gi-Oh! Konami is finally reprinting the original LOB set. The first ever Yu-Gi-Oh! TCG product. Being made available as a standalone booster. What does this mean going forward? We do not know. Evolutions, it's a reprint of the base set. These things have had the biggest meteoric rise in like Pokemon card history. Released back in the year 2016 for around $90 a box. Now just six years later, that same box goes for over $800. Celebrations, the 25th anniversary of Pokemon. They reprinted base set cards, the big three. Right now, there's a brand new Celebrations product that just released that's worth over $300. The product is extremely sought after and most likely will be very limited. So LOB is going to have unlimited boxes again, all 126 cards. I mean, this is... This is why Unlimited is risky. They can always do whatever they want with it. Unlimited booster boxes. I always said that they are prone to reprints. This product will most likely be super printed. Like it will not be just average printing. This will be printed into the ground. If the hype is real, everybody comes in on it. I'm extremely excited that they're doing this. I wonder if they'll throw anything in the packs. Maybe they'll throw in like a 25th anniversary card inside one of the packs. That'd be pretty cool. So I bought one and another, but I admit I was I'm not gonna get my hopes up, but you never know. I think that it is a good way to bring a lot of old collectors back. Unlimited booster boxes back on shelves again. I don't know. This could have game-breaking potential and market-breaking potential, really. Look at this and use caution.